Hello and welcome to Flutter, Android and iOS Uber and InDriver clone app using Firebase as backend. We will develop a fully functional rider and user app just like Uber clone with Flutter new versions and with Flutter null safety. So let me just show you guys the overview of the driver and user app which we will develop in this course. So just like in Uber or in driver we have basically two types of people. One app is for the users, common users and the other one is for the drivers who can register as a driver and start earning money by receiving request from users. Okay, trip. So let's just register. I will quickly fill up this form. registering please wait congratulations your account has been created now after that it will ask you for the car details so you have to put the car details here for example your car model car number and of course the car color and you have to choose your car type from this list for example this one is the uber x uber go or bike so i will choose uber x and click next so when the driver register for the first time or let's say logged in for the i mean for the first time or so mean so when the driver logged in or registered for the first time then when the app starts okay the driver is by default the driver is offline as you can see the map is uh, you can say blur at the background so the driver has to click on this offline now button in order to become online here you can see to the driver is showing that is you are online now and here is the icon which is showing that is you can see the signal is passing that is the driver is online and this driver name is Johnny Ive driver okay and here is the phone number email the car information and a sign out button now here if you come here the here is the uh, overall average ratings okay for this driver whose name is Johnny Ive currently as you know Johnny Ive is a new driver so that's why there is no rating okay remember this thing now here according to the ratings it will display the status of the driver let's just first test the app then you will see how it works and if you come here to the earnings then the earning is zero and total trips completed are zero Similarly, we have the user app where the user can register as a user. I have already created a user, so let's just quickly log in. You are logged in now. So when the user logged in, it will display the nearby all online available drivers. As you can see, currently there are three drivers, one, two, okay and this is the user current location and here on the driver app this is the driver location which is this driver okay this one by default it is representing the startup or you can say the pickup location or you can say the home location of the user okay and here the user can of course write the address where the user want to go that is the drop off location so let's just place our I mean first request so click here here we will write the location name for example where we want to go so I will simply order for a park near to my home which is this one Fatmajina Park F9 Park here you can see it will draw a route from the pickup location to the drop up location and you can see here okay from to and the locations so let's just click on request a ride please wait searching for driver so just like in in driver app it will display all the available online all the nearest available drivers okay and with different I mean all the drivers that is you can see here the Uber X, Uber Go and also the bike these are the drivers who are currently online you can see the name the car name okay the model number color etc and the overall ratings for each driver as if you remember this one is the new driver which is currently online on this driver app okay and the rating is zero because he has not yet completed any trip so that's why and here is the price for the 
for the trip or for the ride which is I am currently requesting okay so if I want to order a big car which is Uber X okay this one okay the car name is Tesla Model X 2022 the price is 3.6 dollars and if I want to order the Uber Go which is small car okay Honda Wits Honda CRV then the price is 3 dollars same for the Honda CRV which is 3 dollars okay and for the bike it is only 1 dollar 1 1.0 so just like in end driver you have now the choice to choose your the driver according to the amount you want to pay okay and you can order a simple small bike or a small car or a big car okay that is uber x or uber go so it is totally up to you so now as you know this one is now currently a new one and he is online so let's just order this one just request this one please wait driver found and here we go the notification arrived I hope you can hear the sound of the notification so it is showing the pickup location and the drop off location to the driver so you can the option I mean the driver has the option to cancel or accept it so let's just quickly accept it so to the user it is showing that his driver is coming within four minutes and to the driver it is showing the four minutes as well now this time basically it is calculated between the distance from the driver current location towards the location of the user pickup location okay that is the home location or office location from where the driver will pick the user so yeah now the driver start movement in order to pick the user from his pickup location So upon reaching the driver will park in the correct location and he will stop he or she will stop okay so the driver stop here on site as you can see outside the user home or you can say the user pickup location I hope you can also notice the time that is it decreased to one minute okay so as the driver has arrived the driver will simply click on arrived button so that the user will know that his driver is standing outside my home as you can see that is when the user sit now in the driver car the driver can simply click on the start trip button also to the user it is showing that is going to destination I hope you can see the status which is updating at real time moreover I forgot to tell you guys that is the user has also the option to call driver okay let's say for example if any misunderstanding occur while traveling uh, that is when the driver comes toward the pickup location of user then the user has the choice to call the driver and tell the exact position okay that is exact location just like in uber or in other apps for example if the user click on it then it will simply display the dialog that is to call this person so anyways it is so simple and so easy the driver is going towards the destination and you can see here it is exactly ro rotating on the routes
can see the driver race to the Fatma Jinnah Park gate okay and he is now going to end the trip soon I mean he will park in a proper stop okay that is upon reaching the destination point which you can see here it is ending so the driver has successfully moved the user toward the drop off location from the user pickup location okay so now the driver simply drop off the user and will click the driver will click on the end trip button and here you go so to the driver it is showing that is the trip fare okay the driver car which is uber x type okay as you know it is the car type and the amount which is six dollars this is the total trip amount it has been charged to the rider rider simply means the user okay so to the user it has been charged so the driver will simply collect the cash so the trip has been ended for the driver now to the user it is also showing that is the user has to pay six dollar cash it has been charged okay as you can see so the user has to click on the pay cash now after the pay cash the user will read the driver okay that is how was the trip for example if i trip two then according to the two it is bad okay three good and very good excellent if you want then it is very bad so let us just give four very good and submit so for the user the trip has been ended and the user has already paid go to the ratings then here you can see to the driving it is showing that is very good and let me tell you this is the average of the overall ratings but as you know since the driver is new so the first rating so that is why it is just showing four okay as you know the user has give four ratings to the driver and according to this it will also update the status here on the profile of the driver that is very good driver okay Johnny Ive is very good driver so yeah and if the driver come here to the earnings then it is showing that is total earnings 6 and total trips completed 1 if if the driver come here then here it is showing that is the pickup location drop up location the date time and the amount for that trip or that ride okay so this is the trip history of the driver so now also one more thing is similarly the user can also check their own history so it is showing the overall complete trip history for the user whose name is Muhammad Ali okay and here you can see this was this one was the latest one okay the date and time you can check from G11 to Fatma Jinnah Park and here you can see the total amount as well and one more thing is as I told you guys it has the we will implement uh, one more last feature which I want to show you guys is basically that is if the driver app is minimized or let's say if the driver app is closed okay then in that case let's say if we send a write request to that same uh, driver then the notification will received by that driver okay in his phone or on her phone okay so anyways for example I want to search first for a place which is Lakeview Lakeview Park okay so the pickup location to the drop up location this is the user pickup location drop up location and as you know so let's click on request a ride searching for driver so it will bring an updated list of all the available nearest available drivers okay so here you can see the price from the user pickup location towards the destination which is Lakeview Park now seven dollars okay and here is the name of the driver and all the information and as you remember uh, the Johnny Ive has four ratings okay so now uh, when the driver app is minimized okay then the driver will receive a push notification let's just let me just show it to you let's just send notification to this driver currently he is uh, I mean on this phone so as you can see here the notification arrived if I show you 
then the push notification has been received new ride request the time which is just now and drop off address which is Lakeview Park so if we click on this notification so it will bring the notification that is new ride request the pickup location drop up location so the driver has to accept or cancel let's just cancel it okay and let's cancel it so yes this is all about our uber and in driver clone app so i hope you will love this course and yes we will add further more new features in this app so i hope you will love this course and you will learn many things from this course that is how you can develop your own fully functional flutter android and ios application with firebase as backend and with flutter null safety that is with flutter new versions so yeah you will be you will be able to make your own fully functional location based application as well as all kind of flutter android and ios backend applications after completing this course so yeah see you guys in the course by for now